fine. You're fine. Now let's see if we can get your mama. Nope. She's gonna do that again. She wants him to follow her. We're gonna have to do what we always have been doing and tie him up behind. I wonder if we tie him right here. Yeah, try that, try that. There she is. Come on. You know the drill. Just take a snack. Come on. Come on. Okay, come on. That's a dedicated mother right there. All right, you shake it. Let's see if I can drive her. Go, go. Hey. No, nope, that's not gonna work. Driving's worse. Yep. Just let her do it on her own time, I guess. Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh, snap. What happened? That one is off really bad. The hinge is broken. Let me fix it. That's Jerry. What's wrong with it? Look, the hinge. It's all thin. But I just fixed it. Guess, do we just wait? Yeah, we just wait. Oh, there's an alfalfa trail. That's the trick. Yeah. We actually dropped some on the ground. That helped, didn't it? Is it ready? Wow, wow. She's getting too smart for us. She knows we're gonna close that on her head and she's stuck. We need to do another trap with Take me. a scoop and put it in there. Yeah, we do, we need to rig it. That's what we did last time. We rigged a trap. This needs to be part of my job. She's saying hello to you. Just rubbing on you in this cathedral. We've clogged it up right here and it can't get through to drain. That's I gotta be some of our That's problem. We need a rake. Look at you. Use it up where it I'll make it do or do without look. Oh, did you make that handle? It's on the edge of it. Yeah. Okay. All right. <laughs> good job. I figured that was good. Then you didn't let the oh, stuff in Oh, 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 oh. There's part of our problem. You think piling it up there is good? Keep it from going mm -hmm. underneath? All right. So much for that, right? What are you doing with that? Picking up the shavings. Makes it easier to put it out. Watch. Nice. It's so much easier than. Oh wow. Oh my gosh. This is the third time she's pooped in the last 20 minutes. Really? Yeah. Well, now we have our poop wheelbarrow. I turned that all the way off. I don't know. It might have been, but put, yeah, put that there, and we'll see if we turned it off successfully this time. It's gonna be terribly annoying. This calf right here. Or good, it might be annoying, or it might be good because mom thinks the calf's back here nursing and she's gonna release better. Oh, Papa, do you want me I think to we have caught that. We have turned that off. He likes this one a lot, Papa. You gonna get them out while I go process this milk? Yeah. What do you think, guys? You think you're good a gallon? Yeah. How are you guys doing in here? Got a story for you guys. When we were great on the Great American Farm Tour, so we looked to our applications and found a really interesting guy. Oop. With Flossie giving a gallon, that's two half gallons, and then Phyllis yesterday, two gallons, that's four, that's six. That's too much for that little cooler. Well, thankfully, we've got another little cooler right under the, the, uh, the doll. So I saw this guy was in New Hampshire. Already cool, man. It's like cold in New Hampshire. He's got pigs, doing some cool stuff with chickens, a little bit of gardening, YouTubing. Seemed like a cool guy. You got the cow out? And you're getting my lids for me. Thank you. Anyway, speaking of cool, it's like, this is like way overkill. I bet it's like 55 degrees outside right now. I wonder how cold it is where he is. Hey, will you bring me the thermopop? See if we can get it down to 40 fast. Oh wow, that's gonna be pretty fast. It's already at 55, that makes sense. Water coming out of the ground at 55. Yesterday's milk and put it in the fridge. That's our old cooler, fresh ice packs. The water's at like 36. 
we'll put Flossie's milk in there. We'll let that cooler cool. And we'll put Phyllis's milk in there. Hey, are you guys improving the place or tearing up the place? Improving our appetites. Oh boy. Thank you. Hey, how's it going? Going good. Shopping? I am. Somebody's got to do it. How cold is it outside, Rebecca? I'm going to text my buddy and see how cold it is out there. It was like a low of 52. Low of 52, y'all. But first, I got to congratulate him on his side-by-side. Uh, -side. Well, I'm not telling you. They're see if they can figure it out. It's a mystery. And that working out you made me do yesterday and the day before, I know my abs are hurting really bad. I worked out a little too hard. Yay. You going with? Okay, let's go. I'm just gonna play one more game. Okay, and then you're gonna pick up after yourself, yeah, right? Make it, you're missing out on the Trash day tomorrow, so let's get these recycles out, Jonah. Right. You grab the camera. All right, let's go do this. You got Phyllis in the stanchion? Uh, yeah. You just burped on national, international television. <laughs> Hopefully you guys didn't hear that. Anyway, this guy's so cool. When we called him to line it up, you know, we got his number from the application, we called him up. He was YouTubing at that very moment. Hello? Hey, how are we doing, Justin? Al said, you just call me Al. You guys recognize that guy? When I when we get there, it's every bit as legit as it is on the videos. Oh, what do you my. remember about New Hampshire? Alumna. <laughs> is that right? That is. That's totally right. Okay, you gave it away. You gave it away. Sorry. That's okay. That's kind. That's what we remember about New Hampshire. Our alumna is New Hampshire to us. I thought it was Massachusetts. <laughs> On the farm tour, we never knew what we were getting into. I mean, you just never know. But Al was one of those guys where, and we never knew how much time to allot anybody, and it all had to do with circumstances and schedule and that kind of thing. Al was one of those guys where we wished we had spent more time. He had great small scale systems, but this is what I remember most about Al. He's walking the talk. He's growing his homestead. He's teaching his uh, viewers how to do it. He's inspiring them. He's become a really good builder, by the way, and he's inspiring a lot of people to build structures, and, and he's teaching a lot of people how to do that. He's, he's kind of coming, turning into the building guy of homesteading. So anyway, but he's showing this lifestyle of clean eating. When you go into his pantry, I've been into his pantry, it's legit. He's walking what he's talking, y'all, full of organic, clean food. It was wonderful to eat with him and his family and just talk about health, talk about clean food, and just, you know, YouTube and just have an overall great time. So what kind of apples are, er, <laughs> where were we with that? <laughs> The apple trees. Apple trees. These, these, these look like they had been abandoned. Yes, this property was an old farm, I guess a potato farm that had been abandoned when we bought it. Nobody was here for about four years. Okay. And what are you, what's your plans for these old apple trees? The plans is to get these back. Come on, man. We're shooting a show here, buddy. Wait your turn. The plan is here to take the apple trees, bring them back to life, and feed what we can't eat to the pigs and the chickens, and then freeze up what we need so we can make apple pies and get a nice old apple cider press. Excuse me, sir. He, he said, you're going to put it in an old apple cider press. All right, done milking. Bring her on. You, you putting moose out just high? Yep. Read on. I've done this in two days. Just I don't let her. Just I don't let her. Hey, hey, hey. Oh. <laughs> Woo! They're both getting really good at that, Phyllis and Jonah. All right, this afternoon we're getting them out of the nursery. We're gonna put them way back up in the field. 
with the sheep, okay? I think the calf's amble enough to walk down from there. What do you think, Jonah? Yeah. I mean, it's inconvenient down there, but that's the sheep. That's the... Hey, did you move the luchadors? Yep. You did? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Did you give them some hay? Shoot, no. We got to give them some hay. Get in, Lily. That... What are y'all doing? Playing. Playing in here! Hello. I don't know. Hello. Uh, hi. Guys, we're going to go do our family workout, okay? Uh, yeah, that's all. It's all good for us. Let's just get out there and get some breathing. Let's do some stuff together. That's cold. Why are you pulling pine in there? Oh yeah, look. We went to be forty. It's gonna be forty on the dot. It's forty-one. I'm gonna say close enough. See how cold it. By the time we get the milk in there. Al texted me back. You're not gonna believe how cold it is there. And I was hoping he bit. He took the bait. He asked me how cold it is here. He said, he's been loving the side by side. It's 25, <laughs> 25, Al, you don't want to know this. It's 50, it's like 55 degrees. Oh my gosh, you're putting on a sweater. This way Call the inquirer, I'm more underdressed than Mr. Brown. Should we rub it into Al? Sure. Okay. Let's take a picture of ourselves in t-shirts. Okay. Smile. All right, okay. how's that look? We'll send that to Al, rub it in. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna tell him that we're gonna jump in the creek after. I don't know if he knows we're polar plunging yet. It's snowing and freezing rain there too. Oh my gosh. You gotta migrate south, buddy. I, I bring up my buddy Al because I'm proud to say he's part of the 12 days of Christmas. It's the sixth day of Christmas, by the way. Merry Christmas to you guys. I got a gift for you from Al. Like I said, he's kind of like the building no, he is. He's the building homestead guy. He's going to give you 10 tips on building for the homestead. Now, I'll tell you what, it's not at Al's. It's not muddy. We have to deal with mud pretty much all winter because it doesn't stay frozen all winter. Like but I'll take it. I'll take the mud. All right, family workout. Can we do two loads in 30 minutes? Are you thinking about plunging with us? I am. It's that time. All right, you bring a thermopop? Yeah. See how cold this water is. You know, Al invited me up to do a polar plunge in New Hampshire. Papa, carry the John McCain inside for me. That would be fun. The colder, the better for the polar plunge. Go straight in. You're nervous? You get nervous? Yeah, I do. I'm nervous too. Right. Are y'all going before me? You put your head under. Hey, that's longer than you did last first time. A lot less drama too. Okay, so it says it's only 61 degrees out here. Goodness, so warm. The thermopop says 60 degrees. 59. Okay. Okay, Josiah. It's been 30 seconds. Okay, it says 50 degrees. It's always exciting, even if it's 60 degrees outside. Good job. Water's 50. Really? You're not supposed to be out pig food tomorrow morning if we remember. Some of you people giving me a hard time about feeding my chickens to the pigs because I could have ate that. Cock them in, whatever. I like pork better than chicken. <laughs> Turn those chickens into pork any chance I get. All right, this has been charging For like Seven days not because it's supposed to but just because I've been negligent to come up here and test it Did it work this time? It's still butt dead. I don't know what to say Does that mean that's battery's dead? <laughs> Keep growing buddy <laughs> You be sizzling you be baking sizzling in no time. What you got there? Oh, well, there's one of his shoes. And you got El Manzo? Yeah, he's snuggling me.
Mom's getting her photos. Well, he's about to go through the test. Can he walk from here all the way up across the street to there? Since the stall's right there, let's get moose with let's get moose in there instead of with the sheep. Go wide there, Josiah. Okay, let the big mom out. Yeah, now bring her in. Bring him in. Good. Mom's gonna stay here mucking stalls for our animal garden miracle. Rebecca, we're gonna go move the oh, sheep. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, shut the door. Hey, Rebecca, we're gonna go move okay. the All right, sheep. Open it up. And set up the cow fence okay. for their move today. Oh, then we'll come get them. Huge workout climbing this hill with five gallons of water. Sheep are here. They gotta go here. The ninos are coming up. The cows are way down there. They're coming up soon, but we gotta get the sheep moved and set up for the cows. <laughs> Whoo! Dopamine, here we come. We got our new net up. Josiah, come on, let's do this. Sheep, 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 sheep. Our guest today, if you guys want to just sit here and watch them, you might be able to get to pet them. You're so cute. You just be patient and Ow. slow. Oh. What I want them to do is be used to people. And when hey, people come around, I want good things to happen, like fresh hay, Mama can. new grass. Yeah. They're so cute. That might be Sally's ride. I'll come take care of it. What's you come down the sheep. Sure, sure enough, it's Sally's ride to the shop, just regular maintenance. We got the maintenance plan. Uh, sad day though, isn't it Gideon? No. Get all our stuff out. Kids have moved the sheep and the sheep shawl and everything. So I've opened up this lane. This is the new area for the cows. We'll get them in a second. Let's make sure our fence isn't hitting anywhere. There's a down wire, more down gate. Another spot and I got the beautiful one helping me. See through here Becky? Taking a moment to take her to the Upper pasture. I think I could get in here with a mower right now. And then we'll bring the pigs in in the spring and help us reseed it. Yep. This is the end of our lane and it's not touching. This isn't connected. Why do we even have this? What is this? This is some temporary rig Jonah put in. Okay, that's the end of our, that's what it needs to look like, Rebecca. Look, look at how nice that looks. That's the future of our farm. And here is going to be a silvo pasture. Well, the kids brought. The cow's over. He is so cute. All right, mom and I traced it all the way back. Let's see if it's hitting hard. It's not hitting at all. Well, that, that would be helpful if we hooked up the ground. De decent, 7.6. Hey, Papa. Oh, you already got your knife. Good job. Everybody's loving it, it's almost gone. Tomorrow's Chris, uh, New Year's Eve, so okay. everybody's doing well. We're gonna we're gonna stay up, see the ball drop. I, I tell you what, I'm only gonna stay up and see the ball drop if Grandma stays up and see the ball drop. <laughs> now you know, it never happened. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think she's ever stayed up and seen the ball drop, has she? Hey, Daddy. Maybe now. Why? Maybe once and she got mad about it. Now my dad wasn't much one to stay up late either, but he used to let us stay up and we'd all stay up and watch the ball drop. I so think it was because his we're bringing it back. I think his birthday. It's the first. It's the first. Oh. So he would like to stay up yeah. to bring in his birthday. Hey, some are, oh, we weren't done, but for some reason the, the camera cut off there, but basically we're saying, uh, I think we're gonna do this for my dad in memory of my dad. It's been a while since we stayed up till mid midnight on the new year, but I think that would be fun. And I, went to, I told the kids, don't forget though, even though my dad let us stay up that night and he stayed up that night, we still worked on the first <laughs> because we had off school. Just like he used to work us on Saturdays, he would also work us on holidays. And he always used to say, however, however you spend your new year's day, is a good indication of how you're gonna spend the year. So we're gonna work. Oh yeah, one more thing. If you're interested in Al Lumna, go check out his YouTube channel where he is building all kinds of cool stuff for his homestead. 
And if you want some tips from him, we've put one of his videos, he contributed a video to our member area, Do It Yourself Abundance member area, but I'm giving that away for free right now on the 12 days of Christmas. It's the sixth day of Christmas, something like that. Merry Christmas, guys. Go in there and get that for free. That'll be there at least until the fifth, the 12th day of Christmas. After that, you can get it for keeps in my member area. There'll be more on that after the end of the 12 days. But right now, just go and enjoy it. Links in the description.